With rolling power outages and the sky-high cost of gasoline, where can we look for reliable energy? Researchers at Case Western Reserve University believe that source will be from fuel cells. They're developing these small devices to power computers and other electronics and say there is a big future for fuel cells and automobiles. In fact, several auto manufacturers are poised to market their first fuel cell cars. Robert Savinell, professor of chemical engineering and a Case Western Reserve fuel cell researcher, says fuel cells are similar to batteries, but much more efficient. You're putting in hydrogen on one side, oxygen on the other side, electrons go through the sloop, okay, and that's where your electricity comes from, and water is the product. So it's a very clean operation. Besides reducing our dependency on fossil fuels for energy, Safinel says fuel cells will greatly decrease hydrocarbon emissions, which are a major source of air pollution. Fuel cells are already used in space, and the technology is quickly coming down to Earth. Uh, there's a number of projects uh, around the world demonstrating these uh, uh, units for providing power. Oh, for airports, for example, hospitals, uh, apartment complexes, uh, shopping centers. Instead of building new large power plants, uh, economics may make it more uh, reasonable to build smaller power plants distributed where you need the power plants. And that's where fuel cells come in. A major obstacle to large-scale automotive use of fuel cells is the safe storage and dispensing of hydrogen fuel. But researchers are betting that a solution will be found. This is Tom Shrout reporting from Case Western Reserve University, Cleveland.